Hello friends and welcome to Take Two for this Wednesday, November the 15th, 2023. It's home day and I'm Jeannie and I'm so glad you decided to come along for the ride today. Last night, Michael and I had a wonderful opportunity to attend a fundraising banquet for a nonprofit organization located here in this area in Alabama. And it is a, a group that is uh, meets specialized areas of help for different ones who live in this area. It was their 40th anniversary, so of course it was a very big to-do, and we saw a lot of people we hadn't seen in a long time, and it was it was just a very inspirational and really, really blessed evening as we were sitting and listening to these people give their stories to, to give their testimonials of how they've been helped in these specific areas of their lives by this organization. It was something where we could say, wow, they took the hopeless and gave them hope. And actually the word hope is in the name of this organization, this nonprofit. So clearly you could see that they were living up to their name, especially when you heard the stories that some of these people had to tell. And I think about, you know, uh, there are so many areas in my life where I may lose my patience or, or I may complain about something. But then I think, you know what, there are those out there who are far worse off than me that have it much worse. They had no hope. At least I know if there's something in my life that maybe is making me feel hopeless for a moment, I know I can have some solutions quickly because I may have the resources or the wisdom or, you know, just the common sense to uh, remedy situations. So think about this, boys and girls. Are there areas in your life today, today, that you're saying, oh, I'm complaining about this, or I'm angry about that, or, oh, this is so inconveniencing, or stop and think about all the people who have it worse than you. And trust me, it wouldn't take long for you to figure out that there are folks out there that have it worse than you do, okay? Now listen, go out and be a blessing to somebody today because you may end up being the only one who is. And it may be somebody who is in a situation where they're feeling hopeless. You be the one to go and give them that little measure of hope. And believe me, it will grow, it will blossom like those testimonials we heard last night. Hope is something that can really, really grow in a person's life. All they need is somebody to help plant those seeds of hope in their lives. Now listen, don't forget, become a subscriber to this YouTube channel if you haven't done so already. Jeannie Sigler, J-E-A-N-N-E-S-I-G-L-E-R. Hit the subscribe button, that notification bell, and you'll be notified every time another Take Two is posting. And don't forget, please tune into my program, Through the Eyes of a New York Woman, heard every Saturday at 9 Eastern a, uh, at, and 8 Central AM and PM on ultimateoldiesradio.com. And you could also listen to an encore presentation on oldies700.com on Sundays. And that's at 4 Central, 5 Eastern AM and PM, oldies700.com. Okay, I love you all very much. And I hope you have a wonderful day. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye for now.